Hey everyone, today I'm going to be doing a haul. A lot of you were requesting makeup haul for quite a while. So today I thought that I've been piling on some stuff for a while now. So I should do a haul now is the correct time. And um, if you're not a very big fan of long videos, then maybe this is not your video because it's going to be a huge haul. So if that's the case, you can skip this video. I don't have any problem. But yeah, there's a lot of makeup which you can see. So, um, you know, if you want to just then keep on watching. So the first thing that I bought was that I, uh, there was this color essence whole kit, The it was named as the bridal shingar kit. So I bought that kit because it had a lot of stuff in it and it was at a very reasonable price. So I said let's go ahead and try. Um, so the first thing they had was this aqua shimmer base. It's a kind of a foundation. Um, it's an okay foundation. Uh, it's just that um, it can make your skin feel a little. I've used it in my uh, tutorials as well. And this is in the shade what shade is beige hope you can see that um, I, what I felt was I'm not going to do a, um, a review like a very detailed review if you want you can comment for anything out of these products if you want any detailed review please comment and I would love to do a review for you all but I felt it was an okay foundation which gives you a very nice coverage and it also has some shimmer which makes your skin reflected back when it reflected back when it's in light. It doesn't seem like it's shimmery like big glitters, but it's more of um, reflecting polymers. All of the packaging of the Color Essence product is very very sleek and nice. And packaging, if it's sleek and nice, half of the done is uh, half of the work is done for impressing me. So I really really love the packaging. It's the Color Essence Aqua Shimmer Base. Second, there was uh, the Color Essence. Um, color your supreme eyeliner i really really like this liner i'll just show you this all came in a huge box which i threw away because it was um taking a lot of space it's um its packaging is like this it's sleek and black pretty and the tip is like this very very thin and precise the eyeliner is nice as well the next uh, thing is uh, the color sense kajal bridal kajal it's I've, I'm using this in my videos regularly and it's the triangular kajal. I've never used a triangular kajal because I felt it was very awkward and weird but I fell in love with this kajal. It stays on for real long and it's super black, dark and intense. And the packaging as all is sleek. Then there were four lipsticks with it. I am not a big fan of these lipsticks. The colors might be nice but they're not very smooth on the lips. That's what I didn't like. The first color is Passionate Pink. And what it looks like is this pretty color. It's a very pretty color. Somebody's coming. Hello? Naiji, how many are The next color which I am loving uh, also is uh, Ruby Rust. It looks like this. It's a very pretty, almost nude for my skin tone shade. Then there is a dark color Pearly Mauve. Looks like this. And the fourth lipstick, where did it go? Let me search. Oh, here it is. No, it's not. Where did it go? Here it is. And the fourth lipstick, Fire Desire, which I have been using in my week, two of my videos. It's a deep red, and I love this shade. Then there was a thing which I can never, I cannot use for the next ten years. I guess it's the Aqua Sindoor because it was the bridal kit they gave this Aqua Sindoor as well. Haven't used, don't know how it is. Next is the eyeshadow palette. It's the satin eyeshadow. It's its name is Satin Eyeshadows and it's in the shade. Um, what's the shade? Fire Desire. And these shades are so pretty. I've been using them in my tutorials. And they're just so pretty, oh my gosh. And they're so pigmented and they're so just pretty. And they just stand out. They stand out so nicely. Then their kit included a lip gloss which is so pigmented. And it's such a pretty shade. It's the Color Sense Liquid Lip Color. It's very very pigmented, stays on for real long. And the shade is Sweet Pink. 
but you can see that with the shade is very pretty then they also had the compact powder which is okay it's okay it has a the powder is here and they have a puff down below powder and there goes the plastic packaging that's the compact then there are an, uh, then there is this shimmer highlighter which is really really pigmented and it's it's not pigmented it's like the shimmer is the shimmer is very very nice it gives off a golden sheen i'll just show it to you hope you can see that i really like this one highlighter then there's this blush that I've been using in my videos and I've got such good compliments for this blush. It's really pigmented. It, the color is so pretty plus it just just very pigmented. Ah, the blush is not coming out. There it is. Such a pretty color, isn't it? I love this shade. I've been wearing it on a daily basis as well. And there were two nail polishes along with it as well. One is red and its name is Valentine. It's blood red. And the other is golden and its name is Current. So this was the kit, Color Essence kit. And apart from that also I've been buying a lot of makeup. Um, the first thing I'd like to show you guys is um, this Giorani pressed bronzing pearls. I'm a fan of bronzing pearls as you would be knowing. I use them in my videos. This is a pressed bronzing pearl, meaning it's like has a puff here, and then it's there it is. It's in the shade uh, Natural Radiance, and I love it. It's so sleek. It's easy to carry because bronzing pearls is a very thick box, but this is very very sleek. Love it. Then I bought the uh, Marcel Marongu palette by oriflame it was marcel palette i call it the marcel palette because i don't know how to pronounce his so name it's more in you but um the packaging oh my god oh my god so shiny and so high street then the colors are amazing as well it's for a smoky eye you can use like here are the warm tones golden silvers the lipsticks are pretty as well suits the indian tones very well and even the blusher is pretty hope you can see that this is the Marcel makeup palette for oriflame then, uh, then, then, then I bought these two lipsticks from um, Inglot freedom system both are very very pretty I had to try on so many colors to find these two and these are very very pigmented are true to the color what you see is what you get on the lips this is a number 68 the only thing i don't like about inglot is they don't keep names because i cannot remember names this is number 68 pretty pink color oops it's opened it opened then there is number 50 pretty rusty pinkish undertones color then another thing from inglot that i bought ugh was this eyeshadow um, it's in number it's the rainbow eyeshadow in LH27CC such a simple name it's basically purple colors and um, the colors I'm saying because it's the rainbow eyeshadow which has three eyeshadows in it there you go purple tones so I bought that from Inglot then I got two prizes from a contest which I won. It was a Beauty Diaries Electric Eyes Contest and I got this L'Oreal Contour Coal in brown shade which is... Its name... Does it have a name? Yeah, it is Iced Chestnut. It's a brown pencil by L'Oreal. Brown coal, contour coal. Then also I got this um, L'Oreal Eyeshadow in the shade kryptonite cream pretty shade then my aunt went to London and she got this lip gloss from me it's red herring lip gloss I don't know what company this is it's and I don't know the shade as well but it's just like a pink dark purple dark pink purplish shade then uh, uh, 
I just saw the footage of the previous video and I thought that the <coughs> bronzing, pressed bronzing pearls weren't very clear. So I'm going to show them to you once again so that you can clearly see how they look like. The bronzing pearls look like. It's like this. I hope you can see now. If not, I'll just include a photograph of it. Then I have been crazily holding over um, kajals because you know my love for kajals, I love wearing them. Um, so first one is this by Extra Lasting Avon. It's a kajal and um, blender combo. So here's what the kajal looks like. And on the other side is the blender. And then I bought the colossal kajal as well. This is one of my favourites, I keep restocking them. Then... I bought a very me kajals as well. Uh, I guess it was an offer or some kind. That's why I bought two. I don't remember exactly why. Then this I bought this new launch from Avon. This is the um, multi stick eye precious amethyst. It's like um, this, and you just have to um, open up the cap. In the crayons we had in um, child when we used to have to put it down. When we used to have to work kind of English, am I speaking? Just put it down and press it above to get the other color out so it has a purple blue and a black hope you can see that or oh, not too close turns dark hope you can see that I have to still try this I just took it out from packaging if you saw um, then these are the things that I got yesterday so I haven't yet tried them two lipsticks from Oriflame um, pure color intense one is in warm rust really pretty dark shade which is very very in for fall look because dark uh, reds and maroons are really in for fall this time and the second one is um, cherry campote which looks like this another dark shade hope you can see that then I bought two where's the second one two Giordani gold jewel lipsticks and oh my god the packaging is out of this world I really really love the way they've packaged their lipsticks let me just show you how beautiful and stunning is that so this color is called honey chestnut it's like a brown with orange undertones in it it's really really pretty flatters Indian skin tones amazingly well and the packaging is as I told uh, said that good packaging does have the work of impressing me the second color I fell in love with this color as soon as I saw it and I think you would too it's such a beautiful pink, uh, light pink and it suits my skin tone so bloody well. And it's just really pretty shade, really pretty shade. Um, I'm going to show you some nail polishes now, which I hoarded. First one is um, this Nailwear Pro in Mulberry. I was wearing this for a week on my nails and my feet and it's really pretty shade. Then this one my sister got from um, Singapore for me. It's a purple color. Then we have nail juice. It's um, it's kind of a nude color you can say. Nude metallic color in the color red. They've written red but I don't think it's red. It's some other shade. Then there's this bubblegum pink. Then there's this brownish color which is called honey. And then there is this a metallic mauve color which is called onion and then mint which was really really in I got this mint shade it's called green passion and it's from streetwear I'll just remove that for you guys okay so what else can I see now yeah so because it's winter time skincare is going to be a huge mess for me um, I got this oriflame milk and honey nourishing hand and body cream it, I have to still try this. I had this before before also and I really really loved it because it's very, um, I cannot take, for me as a person, cold cream, like very heavy creams make me feel suffocated. I like a lighter formula and this one was a light formula and if you can see how gooey that is, then you can make out from that. Let me pull this stuff towards myself. I can, if I, if it's open, oh it's not open. But it smells amazing. Then I got these two nourishing cold creams from A1 Care. One is in licorice and one is with almond oil. Do you want to see the packaging? Just open it. 
looks like this pretty basic plastic packaging nothing very fancy schmancy the other one is the same with the brownish base then I got this it's um, she butter it's like pure she butter uh, from African extracts and uh, I, when I tried this at the store oh my god it was so smooth it's like very thick it's almost like a butter it is a butter so it's very very thick and you just have to use like a tiny bit and it spreads all over and it makes her hands amazingly soft so I got she butter for winters moving on to some hair products let me just quickly get them first of all this was um, it's in Chinese so I really don't know what it is but it's um, I mean I know what this is but I don't know what it says it's like a holding spray like you spray it on and then you curl your hair it holds the curls it's like it has a it's it's a nozzle it has a nozzle like this my sister got this from Singapore for me because she knows how of a curl fanatic I am and to go with that she also got these curlers for me which do amazingly well curls I curled my hair with this like so many times and I got so many compliments I'm gonna do a tutorial with these soon as well how to use these and um, they're so pretty easy and you know gives amazing results then I got a hair dryer from Philips if you wanna see that bit let me just open it up for you guys it's blue it's very handy easy for traveling looks like this it has a nozzle also for more concentrated air and like it's you can fix it uh, like that and you can take it off also very easy it's very very handy for traveling and that's why I bought it because I am a space fanatic I have a lot of space but I have more stuff than the so space. the last thing I have these rollers these are pretty huge rollers as you can see and I'm sorry for the sound in the background my gardener is mowing the uh, my garden so um, I have these rollers these are pretty huge as you can see they're velcro so they stick on to your hair they don't they just stick on to your hair they just stick on to your hair and it doesn't fall off epic fail but yeah, as you can see this stuck on from the end so that like you have to do it completely and I have some thick hair so I bought these uh, thick rollers with that we complete our haul uh, and I uh, you requested a lot so I did that I hope you guys like it and know me I'm trying to show off the products that I have because I won't get the sense of showing I'm in no way showing them off and I know I'm for a long period of time I don't do a video then I come up for one video saying I've been busy and then I go disappear again I'm sorry because really that's what happening it's not been a very ge generous year on me 2012 has been very very bad for me but I am so sorry so I deserve I thought that you guys deserve more than the problems did because I love you all so I think I would get onto track soon and why am I swinging okay so about that so I think I would get back on track soon and this was my haul you all requested a lot so here it is and I will be doing other videos if you want to know any specific products review write in the description box any other request write it in the description box anything that you like didn't like write it in the description box and let me know if you have any other requests or reviews and anything which I already said but I'm saying it again because I'm hyper while I'm filming any video. So yes and please rate, comment and subscribe. I would love to you, love to you. I would love if, it, if you guys would subscribe to me and see that the hard work I'm doing for you guys. So yes that was today for today's haul. Um, I will see you guys in the next video. Till then please take care and I love you again. Bye.